welcome to Vlogmas Day 1. <laughs> first day of vlogmas um it is around a quarter till five and i am just getting ready to start my friday and for those who know me know that i don't like to be rushed in the morning um so i'm not one of those people who can just get ready and run out the door so um just enjoying a little bit of toast enjoying my christmas tree and gonna catch up on some news. So uh, that's what's going on this morning. I'm a little nervous about some days of Vlogmas because you're going to see how boring my life really is. Um, so yeah, this is a typical start to my day and I'm just getting to enjoy my Christmas tree. And I don't know, let me see if it'll, if you notice very subtly my tree is twinkling. I don't love those really flashy lights, so I found the perfect twinkle lights for your Christmas tree. Um, I'll leave them linked down below. They're just perfect. They're super subtle and just enough twinkle. Um, so I really enjoy them. So I have some toast, I have my coffee, then I have my vitamins to take, and I'm gonna watch some news. And that's gonna be the start of my day. So I am all set to head to work. Today's like a super casual day, so I'm just wearing like a plaid shirt with um, this vest and some navy blue pants. Uh, yeah, Fridays are usually my pretty casual day. I have no real meetings. So yeah, it's time to head off to work. I'm going to order some Starbucks. Um, also, this is my favorite holiday wallpaper right now. Look how cute that is. I'm actually going to leave a link to the image in case you want to make it your wallpaper. Coffee is ordered. Time to head off to work. I need a haircut this weekend. So it is now around 5 o'clock and I'm leaving work. So that gives you like a little bit perspective about my day. So get up a, sometime around 4ish. Um, and then basically at work for 12 hours. It was a great day though. It is one of those days where you remember how lucky you are to get to do the work that you do. Um, I feel incredibly blessed to have a job that like I couldn't imagine working with better people or doing more important work. Um, it's just a great Friday. Things that I've been loving lately in my drives to and from work, I will share. Once again, Kelly Clarkson, Meaning of Life. If you don't have the album, do God's work and get it because it is really that good. Um, and then there is a podcast that I have been loving tremendously and it is called Terrible Thanks for Asking. And I'm not gonna share the woman's name because I don't wanna get it wrong, but um, 
she talks about the experience of a loss. So in a six week period, she miscarried, lost her father, and her husband died from brain cancer. Um, and she talks about like this idea of like, when people ask you how you are and like we all say fine, um, what that ends up actually doing and that it's okay to be like, I'm not great and to be vulnerable. Um, and she really talks about that healing process and I'm very much enjoying her podcast that's called Terrible Thanks for Asking. I also just ordered her book and a couple things off her website. I've been really inspired by her. I will tell you though, do not think you're going to listen to this podcast without crying at some point, um, but also you'll laugh. Um, she's a pretty incredible person. So, home. Um, and now it's uh, probably like closer to 5.30. Um, letting Bob is out. I have some packages that I need to open. Do you want to get a cookie? you want to get a cookie? Oh my goodness, yes, get a cookie. Um, so I'm going to get cleaned up, get my contacts out, and I am honestly going to have my PJs on before six o'clock because we are wild and crazy here on a Friday night. You want a cookie? Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Get ready, sit, sit, sit. He really doesn't do anything. All right, so I'm gonna go get cleaned up, put on my pajamas, and then when I come back, we're gonna open some advent calendars. I am now cleaned up and I'm in my pajamas already. Um, and don't be jealous, I have these, I'm like rocking these amazing Christmas dog pajamas, my slippers and my robe. Um, pajamas are from Old Navy. Um, they have some great Christmas pajamas always this time of year. Um, I got two Amazon packages, so I'm gonna go ahead and open those and see what they are. Oh my gosh, I wasn't expecting this because it wasn't supposed to come until Sunday. Um, but that podcast I was talking to you about, um, her name is Nora Permort. And the book is called It's Okay to Laugh. Crying is Cool Too, a memoir. So this is her memoir. Um, really excited to read this. But the podcast, once again, is called um, Terrible Thanks for Asking. Really excited to pick this up. Let me go ahead and grab the other box that came. And I actually know that that box also is two books. Um, I'm really trying to read some like seasonal fun books. So I'm currently reading, I forget the name of it. By the end of the day, I'm mentally done. But I got, um, this looks kind of gross and grimy. I got Seven Days of Us, um, which is supposed to be a really great winter tale. And I also got Mr. Dickens and his Carol. Should we open advent calendars? What is it? Should we open advent calendars? Oh, a lot of you asked on Instagram where these candlesticks are from. They are from Ikea. Um, they're really great and I'm excited about them. All right, let's go ahead and start with rituals. Oh, let's just enjoy some of these because they are beautiful. So that's the rituals. That's the David's tea. It's a lush one. Um, what is this called again? Atelier Cologne. And then the mother of all calendars. We'll save that one for last, the diptyque. But here is day one. And my goal is to open these without ruining them. This is a hydrating hand lotion in Indian rose and sweet almond oil. Mmm. Let's go ahead and try it out. Whew. It is super flowery, which it's Indian rose. Oh, it's a little too strong for me. Now for the David's tea. Let me tell you, this is so high quality. Like, it's just beautiful. And one is right front and center. What's great about this is when you pull it out, all the information is on the bottom. So this one is called Let It Snow. And you get a little tin of loose tea. Um, and it says you'll make it like around two cups. And then also the name of it is on the back. I can't open it right now, I don't think, because my hands have lotion on it. But let me go ahead and see if I can. These are so nice. It smells like it has some orange in it. It 
some clove. It smells really Christmassy. Um, and I love that it, it's a Christmassy scent in a green tea. You don't always get that with green teas. So yay, I'm gonna try that tonight um, as I'm editing the vlog. Lush we have to skip because it is 12 days. Oh, this one looks like it's gonna be hard. Um, but I think I just found one. My goal is not to rip any of these, but I just feel that that is not going to happen. And then it will drive me crazy. Um, the first scent is Cafe Tuberose. Mm, it reminds me of something and I cannot place it. And then number one of the Diptyque. First of all, can we just look at this? It is so stinking pretty. And just so you know, like it closes and opens like an enormous book. It's just gorgeous. And there is numero uno. So let's go ahead and... And I wish you had could smell this because it just smells amazing. Oh my god, this is the one I really don't want to rip. Bays! This is one of my favorites. It smells like a little bit like baby powder. It's super clean, super fresh. And these are like the nice little like votive size candles. I really am excited about that. That's a good way to come home from a really great day of work on a Friday. To get a little, um, little treats from the advent calendar, to have some books to open. That is a good start to Friday night in my book. Also, I had a delivery at work today as well. Um, and I got the little book of skincare that I'm excited to read. Um, so yeah, I got like four new books. That is quite a lot. Also picked up one of these. It's called, it's by Olika. It's called a Birdie. It is a two-in-one hand sanitizer. So the top part is a spray. The bottom part has wipes. Um, excited about giving this a try as well. All right, so it is going on six o'clock. Steven isn't home yet, but he is picking up dinner. I'm going to do what I always do when I come home. Uh, when I have a little bit of time, I'm going to turn on the view that I DVR every single day and I'm going to snuggle with Bubba's and then also light my evergreen candle from Bath and Body Works and I'm just going to get something to drink. It might be alcoholic, who knows? Um, Alright, so I will see you after I have a little bit of time to just chill out and rest. Oh my goodness gang, so that is what I'm thinking will be the first day of Vlogmas. Although I wanted to tell you guys, because I didn't have it on this morning, but I just put it back on. It is the Louis Vuitton trunk iPhone case. Um, a lot of you saw on Instagram that I finally picked this bad boy up. And I do have some thoughts. I'm definitely going to keep it because I do love it. I get so many compliments on it. Um, but if I was to give you my honest opinion, it makes your phone enormous. Um... You are more worried about the case than your phone. It is really, really heavy. Um, so not only does it add so much size to your phone, um, it also makes it really heavy. I like can't stick it in my pocket anymore. It like, pulls my pants down. Um, so those are like some of the downfalls with the case, but I really do love it. Um, and it is like a really cool statement accessory. I especially love carrying it with my Retira wallet, but just know it makes your phone so heavy and it's just a lot for a case, but I do, I do like it. So I have to be honest there. Um, all right. So that is going to be a vlogmas day one. I'm happy that I was able to do it with a busy work day. Um, but I wanted to let you know that I also created a Spotify Christmas playlist of my favorite Christmas songs. It'll be linked down in the description box below, along with some other things that were in this vlog. I'll leave all of that down below for you. But I'm going to leave this first Vlogmas Day 1 video like I leave all of them. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and be kind. It is the season of giving. Kindness is free. 